This is blue. You don't like blue. That's completely fine. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. Hey guys, got level here with a brand new overlay pack, animated overlay pack for you guys. Okay. So instead of making like a fancy advertisement for this overlay pack, I decided to just run through it because I just got done setting it up for Streamlabs OBS, which I'm going to make available the dot overlay file for that specific overlay. So technically, if you're using Streamlabs OBS and you download the overlay, download the font, install the font, and then just import that dot overlay file in your settings here. So you go to settings, you go to scene collections, import overlay file, you will have all of that already set up. It will look exactly the way it looks right here, except here you're gonna have to set your own webcam because I put like a, a, a dummy Logitech webcam in there. Uh, your chat will technically be already set up, but you might have to adjust a couple of things, right? That is right here, cool. Go to your gameplay scene. I already placed everything. So whatever is missing, you're just gonna add it. For example, here, there's no game capture because like I'm letting you add that game capture. And then let's go to that be right back scene. It's in there. Social media, I'm gonna show you how to edit that. Uh, stream ending also already in there. Mm, social media scene is not in there. So you can just, you can just add it. So social media and labels bar are a separate scene first of all as you can see there's a transition transition is going to be included in the in the dot overlay file but also in the pack okay i'm not just <laughs> it's not just for people who are using streamlabs obs if you're using obs studio this will also work you will just have to manually add everything to your scene okay but you will get every single uh, file when it comes to the file there's a ton of them okay so you get all everything that i just showed you plus you're gonna get an avatar i should probably show you the some of the static files okay it's kind of a mess here but you basically get seven you even get animated alerts you get seven animated alerts and those are you know quite important alerts you have uh your bits you have donations you have follows you have gifted subs you have hosts you have merch you have raid you have resubs and subscriber i know some of those alerts like uh, resub and merchants it's and gifted subs or alerts that people don't have custom alerts for those like i don't see it all the time so i thought hey you want to flex on your friends you want to flex on other streamers show them hey i have a specific alert just for resubs that's great so uh, starting soon be right back intermission screen all good all right so for the intermission screen one thing that is that needs to be noted is that it has a transparent background so the animation has this transparent background so you can basically move your webcam and you don't have to be super precise in the way that you place it okay so just here when it comes to your in the gameplay scene for example when it comes to your webcam overlay this one is a little bit narrower but you also have access to a full screen uh, 16 by 9 animated camera overlay this one is already animated when it comes to the labels bar this is a i put that also in a separate scene so if you want to add it to other scenes same thing just add a scene on the dot overlay file there will already be this and that and that <laughs> as in uh, most recent follower most recent cheerer and most recent donator but if you do not like that what you can do is find uh, this a uh, different image right let's say that you're not affiliated for example okay you can get followers that's fine you can't get bits you can't get uh, subscribers but what do you do what do you do well you come to me you go to gumroad.com get level you download this pack and then you realize oh what there's also a labels bar for people who are not affiliated so they can have their followers, their donators and their top donators. OK, and if they're still not satisfied, boom, I have a blank one. Put whatever icons you want to put in there. When it comes to the background, uh, those are image files that I also gave you some, some image files. There's off, off, uh, there's, of course, the offline image in there. Um, but I also give you an animated template when it comes to the background. So this is the static one. I'm going to show you the animated one. So let's say you're not American or you want another scene with another text. All you have to do is just download the font, which is in the description. Okay, it's linked in the description. First of all, first thing you need to do before installing anything is download and install your font. Okay, and then even inside of OBS, add a text source, choose the font, and then type whatever you want, you know? Type it in French and English, and well, maybe not in English, I already done that for you, but you know. So, um, for your Twitch channel itself, I have this avatar thing. So if you're using any editing software, just place an image of yourself or, or whatever you want, your logo, and then just drag and drop this thing on top of it. Boom, instant color scheme approved profile picture okay so we got this social media thing if you want it if you don't want it colored i also have uh this version that you can add 
So this is what you're going to have that's going to be. There you go. Of course, you're going to have some uh, panels. OK, so there's 21 panels, including one that is going to be blank. So same thing. You downloaded the font. Use Microsoft Paint if you need to uh, add your own text. It's all there. OK, everything is give you everything you should need. But let's say you speak another language. You want to make a bunch of new panels with new languages like that's fine. That's fine. Do it yourself. Yay, there's a banner for your Twitch channel right there. The reason why I'm giving you those PNG versions of the animated ones is that if you have a computer that cannot handle animated overlays or you're already skipping frames and you can't or you're streaming at a low bit rate. OK, all of that is going to help you. I even give you image versions of the alerts. So there's animated alerts and I give you those are images. So if you really want to do it easily, basically you go to, I don't know, streamlabs.com, uh, you check your alert box and then you add those one by one. I'm going to show you what the animated ones look like. There's a little bit of uh, animation in there. So there's a follow a subscriber and all of that. I believe I already set that up. Uh, I don't think this will be included in the dot overlay file by the way so you will have to set that up uh, yourself let's test the follow okay just make sure your layout is set to um, text underneath image okay so um, for example when you're going to be on the website so as you can see here there's text on top there's text on the right put the text underneath it okay and then for the size this is going to be 960 by 560 this is my size, but you should probably play around with it. Okay, for example, if you get donations. This is a test donation for dollar. That way people can see the whole text. Okay, what else? Social media is in a separate scene. So if you want to add your social media, you add it to a scene. But if you want to change the social media, for example, your Instagram, it's not gal dot level. Follow me on Instagram, please. Uh, your Instagram is Gabuga. OK, so it, as you can see here, it changes it. And then the scenes where I already placed it, for example, the starting soon scene, it changed it. OK. The intermission screen two. tables bar is already in the dot overlay file, but basically I created a new scene, added this as an image, and then I added a stream label. OK, so plus here stream labels is where is it? Right there. And then I pick the exact one that I wanted, right? I'm not going to make a full tutorial on that. I have so many tutorials. I will definitely link to other tutorials on how to do this. I have a bunch of step by steps. I just don't want to waste too much time. I just want to go over everything that's included in the pack. So you have your overlays, you have animated versions of them. You have a image version of the same animated overlay packs. You have transition. There will be different. Oh, I wanted to show you colors. There will be different colored transition because you cannot change the color of the transition straight into Streamlabs OBS or OBS Studio for now, at least. So if you want to change the color of your overlay, please just go to filters, add a color correction filter and then play with the hue shift. This is blue. You don't like blue. That's completely fine. Boom, 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 boom. OK, this is a complete pack with animated alerts, with animated overlays, animated camera overlay. Uh, there's two different camera overlays. There's one that's wide. That's a 16 by nine. And there's this one that's a little narrower. If you don't want your camera overlay to be too wide, this one is the one that you need to use. If you having if you're having issues to make your camera fit, hold alt on your keyboard in order to crop it. OK, you want it to fit. Boom, you hold alt and then you crop the sides. Just try to keep it centered since the labels bar and the social media and here is um, their scenes. Basically, you can add them by adding a scene. So ending overlay, I want my social media in there. I'm going to click plus. I'm going to click scene and I'm going to click social media, right? Boom, it's in there. OK, Uga Booga on Instagram. <laughs> I'm not Uga Booga on Instagram. Okay? I'm Gail that level. Please follow me. <laughs> and that's it. I believe I said everything. Oh, yeah. How to add the alerts. Good question. All right. I want you to go to streamlabs.com, for example, if you're using Streamlabs. All right. The files are WebM. So make sure you're using a service that allows WebM. As I said before, make sure that your layout is set to text underneath image. So underneath the image, it's right there. OK, you can select your alert and animation. That's your thing. Message template. That's your thing. Text animation, that's your thing. All you have to do here is go here, click change media and then find one of the alerts. In that case, it's follow. I'm going to click 
follow i'm gonna add it i already added it and then it's gonna it'll show up after a couple minutes in here right and once it's in there all i have to do is add my sound if you want to have a sound play around with all those settings like the font size if you want to make it match if you want to change the color of the font underneath the text click save settings go back here you can test it either underneath here test widgets it is not on this scene let's say i wanted to put an alert box on this scene with plus add alert box i already have one but it's fine let's say that i was adding a new one okay add new one remember the size and the width 960 by 560 click ok technically you're done so now you can test your follow and here it is okay and then you can resize you can replace wherever you want you can do whatever you want okay <laughs> If you have any questions, please join my Discord. The link will be in the description. There's like 500 streamers in there and a lot of them already use my overlay. So I, I'm not the only one who can answer your questions, okay? I get so many DMs and I'm basically repeating myself in every single DM. So if each person asks me stuff individually in a DM, like my life is going to be ruined if I take the time to answer everyone. Just all of you, just come together in one, one place where... 500 people can literally answer and help you, okay? Just ask that question in my Discord. Link in the description, okay? And um, yeah, for now, the price is going to be low as usual, I wanna say, but grab it now until the price go up. I'm, I'm purposely not going to say the price in the video because I don't know if I'm gonna keep that price that low. So I don't want it to come back and bite me. Uh, if someone says, yeah, you said in the video it was this price, but now it's this price, nope. I'm not going to say the price. Go on gumroad.com slash get level, figure it out. You will find it. And uh, and yeah, I hope you, pur you purchase it. It would really help me out a lot. And I think it would help you out a lot. Okay. Hopefully you guys enjoy this video and this overlay pack. Uh, feel free to let me know what you think. And uh, if you have any ideas for, for any future overlay packs, just feel free to let me know. I will see you guys later. Thank you so, so much for watching. Get level out.